Welcome back, and I'm going to test a Video Mate uh, VHS rewinder, and I guess fast forward feature. I, that's kind of new to me, but I have no idea if it works or not. I plugged it in and dusted it off. I found this little guy at Goodwill, not far from my house, and I I plugged it in there, and you know I hit rewind, I hit fast forward, I hit oh you know stop, eject, and it opens up. But it had like no life to it and for just a few dollars i thought hey it's worth the risk maybe i can get it working if it doesn't work um but i wanted to test it but the store had no uh vhs's which was kind of odd because sometimes you can at least find a few so anyways i'm going to do a quick test now i just need to find a movie that is not rewound i'm actually pretty good about rewinding movies uh, unless it was so terrible, I just pulled it out and didn't bother rewinding it because uh, why, why, you know, wear out your VCR uh, when a movie's so bad, you're probably just going to throw it away or whatnot. So let me find one and I'll be right back. All right, the movie we're going to test this on that I don't care gets destroyed is going to be Shark by you know has Burt Reynolds in it this movie actually came out in 1969 and was so terrible uh, this is what the cover looks like that's me in the background go dogs but anyways this movie was absolutely awful terrible terrible so if it gets destroyed I won't care I honestly was going to get rid of the movie, but when I found out kind of like the history and the backstory of this movie, it actually really made me like it. Um, so I'm going to actually rewind it, and if the rewinder actually works, I'll tell you about the movie while it rewinds uh, to kill time. And then we'll see just how fast it uh, rewound and you know, see if it works. So let's, uh, let's cross our fingers real quick. Okay. No. <laughs> just jumps and goes and it fast forwarded. So let's see if it or rewind. No, fast forward. Okay, so it looks like it has some resistance. So you would choose what you're going to do first and then press it down. So I'm going to hit rewind and reset that counter. Let's see what happens. Okay, cool. So basically, this movie came out in 1969 and it was one of Burt Reynolds' first movies. Uh, and it was just packed with drama. I want to say Burt Reynolds played the character Kane. I cannot remember for sure. But he's basically like some type of gun runner or smuggler of some sense. And he's like in Africa. And he is just kind of like gets wrapped up in some type of drama between uh, some rich treasure hunters and... Uh, whatever political factions were kind of going on back then. But the movie is really terrible because it jumps around r from like one storyline to the next. There's like a weird love interest that doesn't make sense. Uh, but anyways, but what grabbed my attention about this movie was the fact that in the very opening credits, it shows a shark like sneaking up on uh, a scuba diver who's like looking for treasure and just rips them open like rips them open come to find out that shark attack was real and actually the the stunt man that was killed died like a couple of days later in some hospital in mexico Oop. anyways that's true so he died and they left it in the movie. So when you watch it, that's real. So 
I recommend watching it at least once. But after that, there's really no bother in rewinding. Um, anyways, that's what I know about Shark. So let's see if it actually rewound it all the way. Yeah. And let's see what the counter says. 431. And I want to say this movie is 88 minutes. So that counter seems pretty pointless. But anyways, that's a quick video on this rewinder. I know it works. I'm going to clean it up and... A random fact or history about the movie Shark with Burt Reynolds. It's one of those movies that's terrible, but you should at least see it once. Um, yeah, so like and comment below if you're familiar with that movie. Please subscribe. And I know this was a random one for what my page is, but I know. I'm thought I'd try something new. Let me know what you think.